This is Austin Wells, sales manager with Burien Chevrolet in sunny Burien, Washington. We're the number one volt dealer in the state of Washington, and we have 17 volts in stock, 10 of which are tax-free because they are less than $35,000. Come on down to Burien Chevrolet. We'll show you some tips and tricks on the Chevrolet Volt, and if you don't have time to make it in today, we're going to show you some now in this video. The 2017 Volt is a complete redesign in both the styling and the technology in the vehicle. We start with the iconic Chevrolet bow tie and the new front end of the vehicle, which includes the new projector lens headlights. If you come around the side here, the Volt is an electric car with a gasoline range extender. You'll notice here that the vehicle is charging because it has the blinking LED light. We have this vehicle hooked up to the 240 charger, which is a standard charger size that you can see here. These charging locations are all around Washington State, and you can find them available to plug your vehicle into. Come in close here. This is your charger. Okay, all you do is push it in until you hear the click. You'll see that it lights up and begins blinking when charging. The Chevrolet Volt has a proximity key. You can keep the key in your, in your pocket and then just walk up to the car and press this button to unlock the vehicle. When you enter the vehicle, there's also a push button ignition. And zoom in. You place your foot on the brake and press the glowing blue button to start the car. This is the 110 volt charger. You'll notice that when the light is green, it's ready to charge. The cord is about 25 feet long. The 2017 volt has a new powertrain. It has a 1.5 liter generator that no longer requires premium fuel. We can now use regular gasoline. The range has been extended out to 53 miles of range on average. That's an average that you can get a little bit more or a little bit less depending on how much electrical draw you place on the system. The same radiator that cools the engine also cools down the battery system. We're fighting heat to prolong the battery life but just in case, we provide you with an 8-year or 100,000-mile battery warranty on the vehicle, so you don't have to worry during your ownership period for the vehicle. In order to set the vehicle to maximum charge mode, choose the LEAF from the top five options. The LEAF will bring you into the charging menu. This is where you'll see your power flow chart while the vehicle is running, indicated as the flow chart your charging information, indicated as charging, and up here you'll see your charge limit. The volt defaults to 8 amps and takes almost 16 hours to fully charge. It's 10 to 16. So what you'll want to do is go in here to the charge limit and then set that to maximum so that you can charge in about 8.5 to 10 hours, okay? So when it's at maximum, you're running at 12 amps and the vehicle charges faster than it does at 8 amps. Very important to set that if you're using your 110 volt. The 2017 Chevrolet Volt is equipped with both Android Auto and Apple CarPlay. We're going to show you how to use Apple CarPlay right now. From the Chevrolet Volt's application menu, you want to go ahead and push the home icon. No matter where you get in the system, if you push the home icon, that brings you back to this app menu that has some of the standard features, which includes audio, phone, your projection mode, which will either be Apple CarPlay or Android Auto, your navigation system, your power flow chart that we showed you earlier, the text message app, the Pandora app, and then your settings app to get into your settings. What I want you to do is push Apple CarPlay after you've connected your Apple device with your OEM cable. When you bring up Apple CarPlay, it brings you into a sandbox that allows you to use some of the same apps that you have on your phone, but not all of them. So you can go right into your Maps menu, and it'll load up your maps on your phone. You also have Siri with this, so you can talk to Siri and ask for a location. Navigate to Burien Chevrolet. Navigate to Burien Chevrolet. Getting directions to Burien Chevrolet. We'll see you soon.